Hello dear children, today we will do exercise 6.5 of unit 6 that is fractions. So, here we will see the representation of fractions. So, let's get started. In the following, write the answers on the dotted lines. Now, here one figure is given and the question regarding this figure is given on the left side. So, let's read it. In how many equal parts is the figure divided? Let's count 1, 2 and 3. So, let us write the answer here. 3. Write the fraction for the shaded portion. Now, how many shaded portions are here? 2. And if we have to write the fraction... We have to draw a line here and we have to write the total number of parts in the denominator. So, two parts are shaded that we will write as numerator and total parts will be written as the denominator. Write the fraction for the unshaded portion. Now, how many parts are unshaded? One. Now, if it is a fraction, we have to write the denominator means total number of parts. Now, the second one. In how many equal parts is the figure divided? Now, this is the figure. So, this figure is divided into 8 equal parts. You can count and write it here. Now, how many parts are shaded? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. So, how many parts are shaded? 5. Next is, write the fraction for the unshaded portion. Now, how many parts are unshaded? 3. Then if we are writing fraction, it should have denominator means total number of parts. Okay. So, 3 by 8 is the fraction for the unshaded portion. Now, the next one. Question number 3. In how many equal parts is the figure divided? Now, let's see 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 and 6. So, 6 equal parts. Next, how many parts are unshaded? So, 1, 2. Here only parts. We have to show only parts. So, 2 is the answer. We don't have to write the fraction. Now, next is write the fraction for the unshaded part. Now, here we have to write the fraction. And when we have to write the fraction, it should have the denominator and the numerator. So, unshaded part will be written above the line and total parts will be written below the line. So, this is the fraction. Okay. Now, Write the fraction for the shaded part. Now, how many parts are shaded? 4. If it is a fraction, we have to write the total parts below the line. Now, the next question. Question number 4. Shade 3 by 5 part of each of the following figures red. Now, here we have to see that the figures are divided into 5 parts or not. If the figure is divided into 5 parts, you have to color three parts of that figure with red color. So, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 and all the five parts are equal. So, you will color three parts with the red color. So, you will use red color for coloring the three parts. Now, here also if we talk about this figure, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. This is divided into five equal parts. So, you have to color three parts with red color. Now, the last one also, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. This figure is also divided into five equal parts. So, you have to color three parts with red color. So, let's color. Here, I am coloring one part, second part and the third part. So, like this you have to color three parts out of five equal parts with the red color. Now, second one also. One, here two, here three. So, I have colored three parts. Now, in this figure, let me color one part. Then second part and then third part. So, this is how you have to color three parts out of five parts with the red color. Now, let's move on to the next question. Question number five. Shade four by seven part of each of the following figures with green color okay so here the figures are divided into seven equal parts all these figures are divided into seven equal parts and you have to color out of seven parts you need to color four parts with green color 
सो यू कैन यूज योर कलर्स लाइक दिस यू कैन इवन यूज डार्क और लाइट वॉट एवर कलर यू वॉन्ट टू हेयर इट इज थ्री एंड फोर सो आउट ऑफ सेवन पार्ट्स आई हैव शेडेड फोर पार्ट्स इन द फर्स्ट फिगर नाउ हेयर ऑल्सो दीज आर फोर पार्ट्स सो आई हैव शेडेड फोर पार्ट्स आउट ऑफ टोटल सेवन पार्ट्स नाउ लेट मी शेड हेयर वन टू थ्री एंड फोर दिस इज हाउ यू हैव टू शेड फोर पार्ट्स आउट ऑफ सेवन पार्ट्स विथ ग्रीन कलर यू कैन यूज लाइट और डार्क कलर वॉट एवर यू वॉन्ट ओके सो लाइक दिस नाउ लेट एस मूव ऑन टू द नेक्स्ट क्वेश्चन क्वेश्चन नंबर सिक्स राइट द फ्रैक्शन फॉर द शेडेड पार्ट इन ईच फिगर नाउ हाउ वी राइट द फ्रैक्शन शेडेड पार्ट आर रिटर्न एज न्यूमिरेटर एंड टोटल पार्ट आर रिटर्न एज द डिनोमिनेटर सो डिनोमिनेटर्स आर ऑलरेडी रिटर्न सो लेट एस काउंट द शेडेड पार्ट एंड राइट एज द न्यूमिरेटर सो हेयर वन टू टू पार्ट्स आर शेडेड now in the next figure 1 2 3 4 4 are are shaded and total there are 12 parts now in the next figure out of six parts in fact six equal parts one part is shaded so it will be written here now in the next figure 1 2 3 4 out of five parts four parts are shaded so dear students i hope you would have understood exercise 6.5 